The state is coming together in a big way, demonstrating what it really means to be Nebraska strong. We saw an example of that in Katrina's live shot. There are yes. people out with semis loading up supplies and others who are raising thousands of dollars on social media. New at 5, Channel 8 Eyewitness News reporter Bailey Bischoff caught up with some of them. This is some positive news. Bailey. Mm -hmm. Rod and Megan, we have all seen those photos of loss and devastation across Nebraska, and locals who have seen those two are taking their heartache and turning it into action. We've gotten water, we've gotten snacks, trash bags, I have, there's a bunch of bleach down here. Stacy Saddlemeyer of Lincoln used to live in Fremont. I've got a lot of friends up there, my daughter is up there and I know that they're in they're in need. She's been sitting here in the back of this semi near 48th and Superior for three days, collecting supplies for flood relief. It's heartbreaking to watch the aerial coverage and seeing homes that I had lived in, in water, seeing companies that I've been to, seeing them underwater. She is one of so many coming together to support Nebraska. Some started small and grew bigger than expected, like Alex Deponic. I made a post talking about uh, all of the disaster hitting Nebraska. It caught wind on Facebook, got very popular, and I had a bunch of people, uh, probably about 100, reaching out to me nationwide asking how they could help. He's now raised nearly $200,000. Man, I never expected this. Uh, you guys are amazing. You really show what it means to be Nebraskans and to be Americans and to be part of this world. Lincoln photographer Wynn Wiley has also taken to social media to raise thousands. We just hit 40K. So you know what? We're going to go for 100K. He wants the donations to go to low-income families who likely didn't have flood insurance when the waters took over their homes. If you don't want to donate money, even more are collecting supplies. You know, we really just wanted to have a way to help. Minnie's preschool and daycare is collecting necessities and items for children outside their location near 48th and Van Dorn. So diapers, wipes, formula. And a truckload of supplies from Lincolnites was dropped off in North Bend at Fremont Monday morning. And if you want to help but only have $5 to spare, a York couple is raising money through bracelets that say Nebraska strong, spreading the message that we are all stronger together. They do have help and support of the community. We don't want them to feel like they've been left by themselves through this tragedy. One donation, one truckload, one dollar at a time. You can also, of course, donate to the Red Cross or Salvation Army. If you write a check to them, just write for Nebraska flood relief on it to ensure it will go directly to that. And I'm going to put the information on how to get involved in all of these relief efforts and more on our website, klknTV.com.